One, two, three, it's Diesel in the house, baby, doing what I do, handling my business, being as I be. And y'all can guarantee that I'm crazy, but consistent. It's Big Diesel up in this thing all day, every day. I don't play. Slanging these guns like some chicken wings, spoon, ping, pow. How you like me now? I got mad style all day, every day, because I don't play like a child handicapped. A for Apple, J for Jack, B for breaking back. 45 pound plates over my back, it's like that. This is serious business, taking creatine and glutamine and whey protein all day, every day. It's a fitness thing. 2013 up in the stage, baby. Wow. Just kidding, y'all. <laughs> What's up, y'all? Larry Hennings in the house. Feeling good. Friday, baby. Woo! It's Friday. What you gonna do with it, man? The weekend. Just took me a day to freaking. Pre-workout, I ain't took none of that, uh, what's that stuff over what call that, um, that hyphy mud, I ain't mess with that hyphy mud, There's somebody asked me about that hyphy mud, uh, this guy on, on, on YouTube called Cali Muscle, he's an inspirational cat, man, dude's in the penal system in California, man, locked up, make a long story short, and he just shares his experience locked up in jail and, and shares to the younger crowd and those that are about to get in trouble, to stay away from trouble, it's easy to get in trouble, it's hard to get out of trouble. Big old cat by 265, solid rip, man. I mean, just, just, and not only that, he's just inspirational. The hyphy mud, he's got his little thing where, there, where I guess, where he was in the, locked up in the penal system. The air was recycled. The air was recycled. So a lot of the uh, convicts in there, you know, the, the inmates didn't have any energy. So they wanted to exercise and have some energy, so they did what they had to do to have energy. So he made this stuff called hyphy mud, which it, it pretty much is a, a, is a teaspoon of coffee grinds. With, with, a, with, a, with a Pepsi and a glass like this. Don't do it. That's all I'm going to say. Stick the pre workout to be all right. Topic at hand, real quick, though, man, is pretty much um, what's the key to getting big? What's the key to growing? The key overall, man, to getting big is just patience and it's time. And I know it's something y'all don't want to hear, but y'all, we already know what it is here from here, man. You ask me a question, I'm going to give you an honest answer. I ain't going to sit up and tell you something. You know what I mean? That, that, that's false. I'm not gonna give you no falsified stuff. I'm gonna give y'all that real stuff. Why y'all real stuff? Why? I'm give you the truth, man. I ain't gonna fake any shit code. It takes time. It's a science. You gotta do the right exercises. It takes patience. And a dude on a video clip I, I, I heard him say, which I agree with, it's, it's, Building muscle, man, is a mental thing more than ever. It's a nutritional thing. It's a lifestyle thing. But it's how you think. It's the way you carry yourself. Whether you're trying to get cut, whether you're trying to get big, whatever the case may be. It's a mind game. It's a mind thing. If you if you if you tell your if you sitting there, okay, this is the thing. If you sitting there comparing yourself to apples and oranges, man, I want my arms to grow, but they ain't gonna never be big as hers. Or I want my calves to get bigger, but they ain't gonna never be big as his. You ain't gonna never succeed, man. You said of comparing yourself to others, you doubting yourself, you putting doubt in your body, you cutting in your muscle. You know, see now I mean you cutting in your muscle growth, your, your gains. So you don't get no gains. But if you tell yourself, I want, I want the best arms, I'm gonna be the baddest dude walking down Rehoboth Boulevard. I'm gonna be the baddest dude in Ocean City walking down the strip. They're gonna look at me and be just just They ain't gonna say that, just gonna be like this. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and a couple of them gonna be like this. Like like they got an onion. I need stuck their face. That's the mentality you got to have. Seriously, man. Just it's an obsession. You gotta be obsessed with what you're doing and adamant and consistent and really push that muscle to the maximum and get out of that freaking rabbit ass comfort zone. Y'all gotta get out your comfort zones, man. Oh, uh, but the biggest thing, one of the things I really I'm gonna say I'm gonna, I'm gonna quit talking, is you need the acronym I came up with to come back with that. The DRE, the diet rest exercise, diet versus rest and exercise. Let's go to rest. You need rest. You hitting, lifting heavy weights. You recruit more muscle fibers and pushing that muscle more to the maximum. So you need that rest. Normally, what I do when I train for size, when I train for mass, for a big muscle, especially legs or back, I take two weeks off. I take two weeks off, and the week in between, while that muscle is resting, like say back, I'll hit biceps if that makes any sense. So say for example, if I do back on Monday, this past Monday, next Monday I won't hit back. I'll hit biceps. But then following the next Monday, then I'll come back to back. And I might mix it up, add back and bodies. But for the most part, I give them big muscles a lot of recuperation because you recruit more muscle fibers. The bigger muscles are stronger, so they, they, they need more rest. 
that works for me. You can try it. If not, you can do your one day a week. But you need that rest, man. You got to need that rest. But more than ever, this thing is, is a recession. It's a mind game. That's what it is. To get big, to get stronger, to get cut, to get defined, it's a mental. You got to believe that it's already there when it's not even there. You got to even tell yourself, okay, man, I got the best six pack. I got the best abs. I got the best. It's a mind thing. You got to believe it. Dream it, believe it, and achieve it. This is Diesel giving y'all that real ain't faking it, ain't sugar coating. You got to take care of yourself. Be cool. I'm out.